Hi guys, I wanted to do a video on my shoe collection, both shoe slash heels, but basically all heels of one pair of boots. Uh, I'm just going to hold them up and show you instead of putting them on and showing you my feet. I don't really feel comfortable showing my feet on the internet, uh, even though I say titties after every single one of my videos. I just, I don't want to show my feet just yet. Um, <laughs> so I may do a video like that when I am better at shooting videos and get a better quality camera. But until then, I will just do this way. So I'm going to start off with the shoey looking ones instead of like heels, but it's still kind of, you'll, I'll show you. So this is the first shoe thingy. It is by Schicks or Skechers. It's Skechers because I'm a fucking idiot. Um, is it Skechers? Girl. Yeah, it's Skechers. I'm just kind of stupid. I, I don't buy shoes a lot. I got these at the thrift store for like, is it the price tag thing? Yes, $9. They have a hidden heel, hidden wedge inside of here. And I've only wore these once and they are kind of comfortable. Not really that super comfortable. I kind of already cracked my ankle the first time I wore them because I was on grass. And, uh, I guess I wouldn't really recommend you wearing these on unstable grounds because you may crack an ankle or roll an ankle, and that's just not fun. It hurts. Uh, so yeah, these are really cute. They come with, like, girl I don't even know how to work my own shoes. Little GoPro strappy thing is, which is good because I hate tying shoes. Literally, when I had normal shoes, I would only have shoes that had no shoelaces. They were only slip-on. Uh, but right now, like, my normal, like, walking shoes are purple, purple, like, running shoes by Skechers, I think, as well, uh, and they're really comfortable, but those are the only shoes I have that have, that has, um, shoelaces, so, yeah, I'm not going to show you those, because I, I don't want to. Okay, so my next ones are boots, these cute Italian-looking boots. And I don't know if the price tag's on this one either. It's not, not right now. But I believe they were only $11 or something, which is kind of expensive. Not really for shoes, because shoes normally are very expensive. But these were at the thrift store as well. I don't know if I already said that. But they are by Comfort Plus Productions, I guess. That's what <laughs> the thing's called. But, you know, they're very comfortable. I used to wear these all the time in the winter. And it's not, they're not super comfortable when you first put them on, when I first got them. I had to break them in, of course, like you do with every shoe that you get, you have to break them in. But these were really comfortable, I love them, I've always wanted a pair of boots. So, you know, cute. My next ones are these heels I am dying to wear sometime. I don't know when I'm going to get the time or day to wear these. I really want to wear them on a date someday, sometime with somebody. Um, and I just don't know when that will happen. But these are really cute. I've wore these mm, twice. Uh, inside, of course, not outside. They are by uh, J.C. Penney's, I think. Uh, East Fifth. I don't know. Uh, but they are very comfortable, kind of. Her heels are very comfortable. Uh, I haven't tested my walking skills uh, that extensively, so I'll get back to you on how comfortable they are when I actually wear them for a long period of time. So yeah, they're very cute though, I really love them, and yeah. These ones are the ones that I wore the most, and I've worn them once on Halloween, and they are the most comfortable heels that I've ever worn in my life, even though, like I said, I haven't worn heels that much, so don't take my advice, I guess. This is also by Payless. This is by Payless, and I forgot to say, the black heels were from, not black heels, the black boots were from Payless as well, because this says Comfort Plus Productions as well on it. These were $22 on, in, Pay less. I'm kind of dumb, sorry. Pay less. And they are so comfortable. I wear this with this dress. You can't see this dress because I have it angled weird. I need to work on my angles one of these days, but I promise I will. Uh, yeah, so 
I love these heels. They just, yeah, I don't know what the hell I'm saying, but they're really cute, and I can't wait to wear them more. So, and also, I have one pair that I'm giving away uh, to somebody. I don't know who yet, because I don't know anybody, but once I do know somebody who would want them and has big enough feet for them, I will give, the, give it to them. Uh, because they're too, too big for me, and I thought they were going to fit and lay down, and I'm really upset about them, because they're freaking cute, and I can't, I'm just so mad. Anyways, so, I apologize that this has hair on it. I wore these yesterday, and these are the, these are the sandal heels that I wear, I wore more than I've ever worn any of the other girl shoes that I have. This is like a small wedge sandal. I got these last year. I can't really remember how much they were. I think they were in the $10 to $15 range, maybe $8. I can't remember. So for $8, you get this really cute sandal, and they're comfortable. They don't hurt your feet at all. Uh, I really love them. They're freaking awesome. I need to get some more open-toed shoes, but I kind of don't. I kind of don't like showing my shoes, my feet not my shoes, because, I don't know, I have weird shaped pinky toes, they're like, my dad likes to call them caveman toes, and caveman pinky toes, because they don't touch the ground, and I just, I'm really self-conscious about my feet, uh, but I need to get more, more heels, more heels, I love heels, okay, so these are the heels that I am giving away to somebody, I don't know who, I got these on eBay, they are so freaking cute, look at that, I'm so mad. They are by Dream Paris. I think these are the ones by JC Penny. Um, but I got these on eBay for how much money is it? Twenty-two dollars, I believe. I can't remember. But they hurt like a bitch, though. Even though they are too big for me, they are size eleven. Which you know what? Which is weird because. These ones from Payless are um, size 11 as well, and these fit me, but these don't fit me, and they're the same size. I really don't get it. Um, they they look the same size as well, see? Like, girl, I don't get it. Maybe open-toed shoes are differently sized or something. I don't, I don't know, but I'm so mad that they aren't my size, I have to give them away, which, I mean, is okay, because some trans women can't find shoes their size, and that's sad, so I'm gonna give it away, give them away, um, <laughs> so yeah, that, those are all of my shoes, not that many, but, uh, actually, no, they are a lot to some people, uh, and to me, they're a lot. But, I know that there are a lot of people who have like 20 pairs of heels, like, I don't get it, like, why would you need that many? <laughs> I don't think I'll ever need 20 heels, but if I ever do, I mean, that'd be awesome if I ever get that many. Uh, I think someone texted me, but I'm gonna just ignore that for right now. Uh, if you like this video, comment down below, like this video, girl, that's not what I was supposed to say. <laughs> Uh, like this video, subscribe, but you really don't have to, I would really appreciate it, and I will talk to you guys later, titties.